Glycohemoglobin Analysis System. The system can provide you accurate HbA1c results. Part 1 consists of two parts Glycohemoglobin Analyzer Kit, Glycohemoglobin Test Kit. The Glycohemoglobin Analyzer Kit contains analyzer, batteries, warranty card, user's manual, operation guide, and cleaning and maintenance guide. The Glycohemoglobin Test Kit contains test strip, buffer A, buffer B, sampler, and code chip. The Analyzer The Analyzer includes screen, up button, down button, OK button, small panel, buffer port, large panel, sampler port, test strip slot, LED detection light, code chip slot, mini USB interface, and battery cover. The test strip. The test strip includes base layer, membrane, membrane cover, absorption layer, and detection hole. Part 2. Setting. Date and time. When the batteries are installed, the analyzer will automatically switch on and enter into the setting mode. Welcome to the A1C Easy Test System. Press up or down button to adjust. Press OK button to confirm. Hour mode, year. Month. Day. Hour and minute will be set successively. After setting is completed, the analyzer will automatically switch off. For audio and metric settings, please refer to the user's manual. Part 3. HbA1c Testing Preparation Besides the Glycohemoglobin Analysis System, please also prepare rubbing alcohol, swab, and lancet before testing. Testing Procedure The testing procedure is code chip insertion, strip insertion, blood sampling, buffer A adding, blood adding, buffer B adding, result reading. Code chip insertion Compare the code number shown on the code chip and the test strip vial. Make sure the code numbers match with each other. Press the OK button to switch on the analyzer. Welcome to the A1C Easy Test System. Please insert the correct calibration code chip. And then insert the code chip. Make sure the code number displayed on the screen matches with that on the strip file. Note, when starting to use a new test kit, please remember to replace the code chip with the new one. Please place the analyzer on the table and do not move it during the test. Strip insertion. Take out a test strip and close the vial immediately. Please insert the test strip. Keep the detection hole facing downward. Carefully slide the strip into the test strip slot until the strip contacts the end of the slot. Note: 1. Avoid bending the strip. 2. Make sure the upper edge of the membrane cover aligns to the lower edge of the sampler port. 3. Make sure the strip clings to the slot without upwarp. Blood sampling. Disinfect the fingertip. Dry it thoroughly. And then prick the fingertip with lancet. Take out a sampler. Touch the thread to the blood drop to absorb the blood. Wait until the thread becomes completely red. Buffer A adding. Unscrew the upper cap of buffer vial to open it. To avoid blocking the buffer port of the analyzer from bubbles, squeeze the bubbles out and then wipe them with the cap. Please add three drops of buffer A. Vertically and continuously, Add three drops of buffer A to the buffer port after the voice prompt. The analyzer will start the 10 second countdown. Note, if the bubble blocks the buffer port, 
Please use a swab stick to pierce the bubble. Blood adding. Please apply the blood sample. Add the blood sample to the sampler port within five seconds after the voice prompt. Remove the sampler after three beeps. The analyzer will automatically start the 130 seconds countdown. Buffer B adding. Please add two drops of buffer B. Vertically and continuously, add two drops of buffer B to the buffer port after the voice prompt. The analyzer will automatically start another 130 seconds countdown. Result reading. The result is 5.0%. Record the result when it is displayed. For EHG result, please press and hold the down button before removal of the strip. Press the OK button to start the next round of testing. Switch off. Press the OK button again to switch off the analyzer. If residue remains on the panels, clean it with a dry cotton swab. Remove the strip to finish the test. Please obey rules to discard all the used components. Part 4. Maintenance and Cleaning In order to get the accurate results, the analyzer should be cleaned daily after testing. Remove the large and small panels from the analyzer. Use swab to clean the panels carefully. Alcohol swabs can be used if necessary. If the LED detection light is contaminated, please wipe the area in a single direction. After cleaning, reinstall the large and small panels back to the analyzer. Thanks for watching Zero Glyco Hemoglobin Analysis System.